the transfer rule has been in place for a super majority of our sports for a long time. And when it came in play for these new, these five sports, you know, which is football and, and basketball and a couple others, uh, I actually told our coaches, you need to go talk to your colleagues, you know, in the soccer program and baseball and others, because they've been going through it for a long time. And, and so um, the, 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 the critical piece uh, of that is to make sure you recruit with character and you make sure you have an environment that young people don't want to leave. Now, if someone wants to leave, and I've always said this with the other sports that where transfers exist before, if someone wants to leave because of true playing time, that's different. If they reach the level and they realize they can't play at the Ohio State University and someone's passed them up, but they want to play and they want to transfer to a school where they can play, let them go. I've always said that. But if they're leaving because they're unhappy or we mistreated them or something of that nature, that's a problem. Don't look at them, look at us. What did we do wrong? And so um, we, we, we are blessed uh, that our coaches uh, embrace that concept and uh, we do our best to try and make sure that in our circle of care, we call it, <clears throat> our student athletes are well taken care of um, and they enjoy their experience and their parents enjoy their experience. Um, but at the end of the day, when they're ready to transfer, uh, we, we try and uh, uh, make sure that it's for the right reasons.